Hey guys, this is EJ Holland with TheWolverine.com here with four-star Michigan cornerback commit Miles Pollard. New Michigan commit exactly. made your decision just a few seconds ago. Tell me a little bit about why Michigan. Well, I chose Michigan uh, really because, I mean, the whole coaching staff is just was on me the whole process. Uh, I really believe they got something special coming to Ann Arbor. Uh, Will Johnson, who was also a big part of uh, playing alongside him, I think that that's going to be great. And then, I mean, the life after football at Michigan is like no other school. Um, just the connections they have is just, it's just different from other schools, I believe. And then it's just, it's just a great place. I mean, I can see myself living there without football, so that's why I chose Michigan. Definitely. So, uh, you know, Michigan was considered a, a big contender for you for a long while. Yeah. I feel like I always knew you were going to end up at Michigan. When did you know you were going to end up at Michigan? Uh, I say probably last week, but I had a feeling a couple months ago, but I still wanted to go through the process. Uh, figure some things out, but uh, last week is really when I set my mind. Set your mind. What? Why did they kind of take that lead for you a couple of months ago, and like, how did they end up closing with you? Uh, I think the official visit really uh, is what made it click for me, and just going in the big house and just seeing all that in person, and just really feeling the vibe, hanging with the players. Coach Harbaugh, the whole staff, it just really clicked to me that this is where I want to be. So, yeah. I know Steve Klinkscale played a big role in your recruitment. I know you really liked Mo Linguist, but as soon as uh, Coach Klink came in, you were super excited. I know you were kind of advocating for him for that job. Tell me a little bit about Coach Klink and your relationship with him. Uh, Coach Klink, he was my first offer when he was at Kentucky, so I've, I've been knowing him for a while. We got a real good relationship, real good, and um, he's just a great leader off the field and on the field. And I think he's a he's the guy that's going to make me to a better person on and off the field for these next three or four. Years. Talk a little bit about some of the other Michigan coaches that were involved in your recruitment and the roles they played. Uh, Coach Harbaugh, he, he always uh, kept in contact with me, just make sure I'm doing good and make sure we're keeping on good tasks with Michigan. And uh, uh, Coach Steven, uh, he's just another person just keeping tabs with me. Really, the whole staff really takes me almost every day, just telling me how much of a priority I am for them and just let them know that they're here for me. So, yeah. You uh, mentioned Will Johnson. Obviously, you do get to live the dream and, and team up together uh, and lock each side down. Tell me a little bit about uh, getting to team up with Will, how excited you are about that, and how you feel you complement each other. Uh, I'm really excited. Will's a great player. I think me and him are going to be a problem on that back end. So, I mean, he's just a great player, a great person, too, off the field. Uh, he's just easy to connect with. I'm already real good friends with him. And I mean, I couldn't be happier with the decision I made to play, go play alongside with him. So, yeah. Michigan made a lot of changes this offseason. Um, they're bringing in talented guys like you and Will. How excited are you about the future of the program? Uh, I think the future is going to be great. Um, we got, Like you said, we got great players coming in. We got a top 10 class right now. And um, I think it's just going to keep going up from here. So I, I'm really excited about the future for Michigan. So uh, I know you've known for a little bit that you've been going to Michigan. So have you already started recruiting guys? Or are you planning on getting to recruit some guys? Uh, I really I haven't started. <laughs> but I'm planning on probably starting probably today. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> who are going to be some big targets for you? Do you have any in mind? Uh, I really got to talk to the coaching staff who they're really coming for. But I know Walter Nolan's a guy that they want really bad. So, I mean, probably him. So, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> cool. So Michigan kind of changed defensive schemes, switching kind of gears back to, to you as a player. They, they switched defensive schemes, going more to a 3-4 defense. Yeah. As far as you as a corner, what have Coach McDonald, Coach Kling told you about how they see you kind of fitting in, and what do you think about the new defense? Uh, they see me playing the outside corner position, just locking it down. I really I like the defense a lot because it's, it's similar to the defense we play in high school. So, I mean, I just feel like I fit the scheme there, too. I mean, uh, Coach McDonald came from the Ravens, so um, I live in Tennessee, so I watch the Titans game. Titans always play the Ravens, and the, the DBs are always out there flying around having fun. They don't really have to think about uh, things too much. They just go out there and have fun. So that's what I want to play under for. So, yeah. Definitely. Um, you know, looking ahead, uh, obviously you've got your decision out of the way. Uh, I know you're kind of focused on your senior season. Tell me a little bit about, you know, what your goals are as a senior. Uh, my goal, uh, main goal is to win state championship. 
uh, personal goal, I say, um, have a chance to win the uh, Mr. Football. And uh, I think third goal is just, just celebrating this last time with my teammates before I head off to college. So. How could I forget to ask you about Junior Coles today, yeah. former teammate, uh, obviously joining him at Michigan. Tell me a little bit about that. Yeah, that's going to that's gonna be great as well, just teaming up with Junior. Uh, he's been back for uh, this break a little bit. I've been with him almost every day. So he, he knew he knew what was about to happen. But it's just, I just can't wait to play with my former teammates. So yeah, I'm ready. Awesome, Miles. Well, we appreciate it, man. Congratulations. Anything else you want to tell the Michigan fans? Go Blue.